All right, this is MTG Buddha back. Uh, we're gonna do another video hunting for um, parallels of pumpkins and Halloween, other Halloween pumpkins and ghosts and all those things. So far, we've got pumpkins and we've got two ghosts. Uh, we haven't gotten any of the numbered ones yet. Uh, I have two more boxes and then I will be out of the boxes that I ordered. And I don't know if I'll buy any more or not, but uh, hoping to pull something one of the Halloween parallels that's numbered this time. It'd be nice to pull a numbered one. I haven't pulled a number one this time or yet, so it'd be nice to pull a numbered one. So we're gonna crack these open real quick and try to go through these last two boxes that I have currently. Uh, I'm really enjoying the parallels. I like it. Um, I'm looking forward to 2024 Series 1. The fact that they're going to have these types of parallels again, except they're going to be Easter themed. Um, I will probably be doing a hunt for Easter themed ones uh, once they put those out. I might I'm gonna look into possibly trying to buy a case, like a whole case of blasters, and see what I can get out of a case. Just try to get as many of the parallels as I can. Uh, keep the ones I want, sell the ones I don't, and then, you know, potentially... Go hunting for some more but uh i'm really enjoying looking for these i think it's a, a fun little thing that they've added in to the retail side um i like the fact that they've done this i'd rather have this be something to find in the packs than the manufactured relics that they've been putting in the last few years so all right so we're gonna check these out we're gonna sort out the rookies to one pile and then all the other base, we're going to just kind of go through these real quick. We're not going to take a lot of time on the on the regular cards. We're going to be looking for the special ones. We're looking for all the numbered ones and things like that. So, looking for rookies and numbered and different parallels. So, no parallels in that pack. Alright, hopefully we'll find at least one number card. I found at least one in every box so far. Um, I found two a couple times, but... Most of the time, we're just finding one. Okay, so we've got something here. This is not numbered, so more than likely, this is just going to be a rainbow foil. Yeah, it's a rainbow foil. Okay, so we'll set that over here. I really like these cards, the laid out. I think they're really nice. Uh, I'm going to go on and sleeve that up because I like these, and I'm probably going to probably going to keep all of these, try to get one of each of these because I think they're pretty cool. So we'll hold on to that, and then it looks like we have our first parallel, so we're going to see what it is. Uh, all right, so we got a parallel here. All right, but it is not one of the special ones, one of the rare. So it is just a regular, and it's a Leote Tavares. So we're going to go on and sleeve that up. All right, and then we'll go on and start looking through the next ones. All right, so turn this. All right, Logan a Hoppy, and turn again. Go two cards and turn again. Oh, all right. Okay, so it looks like we got our first number card. This is number to 2023. So this one's going to be uh, gold. And it's one of the rookie combo ones. It's for the A's. So um, the rookie combos, none of the people on it that I've seen seem to be anybody that I feel like are going to be major players. Uh, there's a Derek Jeter on the 88. That's nice. Uh, let's see, we got that. Do we have, no, nope. just, just on Grissom, so. All right, so no parallel in that pack. So we've gotten one parallel so far. Um, we should get three in each box. Um, we've already got a numbered card, so if we get another numbered card, we'll be doing pretty good to get another numbered card. But um, let's see, okay, so we've got a blue. So we do have a parallel but it's not one of the new parallels this is going to be one of the parallels so we'll see what it is and it is another rookie combo so this is our second parallel out of this box so we should have one more parallel coming hopefully we'll have another numbered card coming out um but let's see let's that over there um all right so we got rookies Let's try to get through these. There's a trout. There's another rookie. Alright, let's see. So we got Jordan Walker. Do we have a parallel behind him? Nope. Alright, so let's look, see if we can maybe find another 
numbered card, that would be nice. Uh, nope, doesn't look like there's going to be one in this pack, although we might have a black gold. Yeah, looks like we have a black gold. Uh, and we do have a Topps Chrome here, so we're going to sleeve that up. I've been sleeving the, the Topps Chrome ones up, just because you usually only find like one of those. Sometimes you don't even find one. Uh, so we've got a black gold, and it is Paul Goldschmidt. So we will sleeve that up, because I like this set as well. This is another one I might try to collect, one of each of them. Um, let's see. Alright, so we've got this. Do we have a parallel? We do, it looks like, have a parallel. So let's see what it is. And it's another combo. So we've gotten three parallels of combo rookies in this box. So that is the third one of these parallels, so we probably won't get another one of these. So let's just go ahead and get through these. Rookie combo, rookie debut. Although we might have another numbered card in here. I'm not sure. I think I thought I saw no. Okay, I thought I saw another backwards card, but I was wrong. All right, we got a Matt Olson on the 88, 88. I believe that's what that is. And then we got a Kodai Singa. All right, so that box not too bad. We our parallels were not what we were really looking for, um, but. Two of them were the combos, and then we also got the combo on the numbered card. So let's go with this last box, and then we'll see what we get out of it. And hopefully we'll get a good card out of this one. I'm definitely sending the Volpe off to get graded. Um, I don't know if I'm going to send any of these other ones off. Uh, there's a couple other cards that I've pulled that I might send to get graded. Um... Got a couple other cards I might send off to get graded, but we'll see what else I pull out of these, out of this box here. If I pull anything good out of here, could be could be pretty nice. Wouldn't mind to get a Goldsmith, Henderson, or Carroll parallel. So far, I haven't got any parallels of any of them. Um, so, let's see if we can find one of them in these last few packs here. And then I think I might try to pick up a couple boxes of Heritage. Uh, I haven't opened any Heritage from this year. Um, I haven't opened a lot this year. Um, I've been just kind of not really buying a lot of packs for like the last year or so. Um, but starting to get back into it a little bit. So I might buy some Heritage. See if I can find anything good in that all right so we're gonna go through these get a little stack here all right so turn so we got rookies rookie debut there's a rookie all right and we got a chrome so we'll sleeve that up We've been sleeving the chromes up. Let's see. Let's grab. Alright, let's go ahead and go back through these. Alright, so we got this. So we're gonna have our first parallel in this box, in this pack. So we're gonna get these two and we're gonna see what this is. So alright, it is a rookie and it is a pumpkin. So we found a pumpkin in this box. Uh, and it is a rookie. Now, again, it's not one of the rookies that I'm really looking forward to. So, not super exciting rookie, but it is a rookie and it is a pumpkin. So, it is something. So, we'll go ahead and sleeve this up. I'm going to put this one out here. Alright, maybe we'll find another one. I haven't found two in a box yet. I don't know if anybody has, so we'll see if we can maybe find a second one. Or maybe we can find a good numbered parallel of one of the good rookies. Alright. So, hopefully we'll get a numbered parallel here before long. Let's see. Not going to get one in this pack. Do we have a other parallel? Nope. No other parallel in this pack. You can usually tell kind of where you're going to get them at in the packs. So 
Let's see, rookie. All right, so, all right, so we do have a parallel. Let's see, it's going to be a Cub, Cody Bellinger. So, and we do not, yeah, we do have a parallel here. So we're going to see who it is. All right, so it is Alfonso Rivas and a Spencer Strider on the MLB. All right, so we will go ahead and sleeve this up. And I believe that is our first parallel out of this box. So we're going to see what else we can find. Braden Shoemake, good. Well. Another rookie. All right, so it looks like we have a numbered card. It looks like it's numbered to 2023. So let's see if we can scoot this over. All right, let's see if we can see what it is. All right. All right, it was an Oriole, unfortunately. Not the Oriole we were hoping for. So would have been nice if it was a Rushman or a Gunnar Henderson. So we got a numbered. It'd be nice to pull another numbered out of this box. So we've got Marvis and no parallel in that one. So, all right. So we got rookie. We got Corbin Carroll. Let's see, Sean Murphy. All right. Looks like we're going to have a parallel here. Is it going to be a rainbow foil or? A numbered card, probably rainbow foil. It is a rainbow foil. Alright, so Leote Tavares. So all right, we have a one Soto on the action stars. And then we have looks like we have a numbered card on the back here. Oh, this is gonna be since it's on the back, it's probably gonna be one of these. And if it's numbered, because I saw a little bit of gold like in the numbering area. That could be a second one out of this box, and it could be like a black cat or something. Let's see. All right, you ready? Nice. It's a black cat on a Bobby Miller. That's the first numbered one of those we have pulled. That is pretty awesome. And I believe the black cats, I believe, are numbered to 10, if I'm not mistaken. So we're going to check that out. Yep. Numbered 6 of 10. Right there. Number 6 of 10, Bobby Miller. All right. We got our first black cat that is our first one of the numbered ones and it is the number to 10 so we didn't even get the number to 50 so that's pretty cool that's awesome so i'm actually going to move one of these guys over to another one because i'm out of stands right now so we're going to put two of them together there and we're going to put him right in the middle so that's probably going to get sent off to get graded so so we've pulled two numbered cards and we've pulled a second halloween parallel out of this box so it's the first time i pulled two halloweens out of one box so that's pretty exciting. I like that. Uh, let's see if we pull anything else. Uh, DeGrom. Let's see. Jared Schuster. Kodai Singa. All right. So it looks like we have... Oh, I think we might have a numbered, another numbered card here. Is this going to be... I think it is a black Topps Chrome. I haven't seen one in person yet. Oh. Is this going to be numbered? Logan O'Hoppy. Yes, it is. To 25. Oh, my goodness. That's awesome. This box has been fire. This box is awesome. Wow. That is so cool. That is another numbered card out of this box. So we've gotten three numbered cards out of this box so far. That is the first MLB... Stars of the MLB parallel that I've actually pulled, and it's a chrome one. I don't know if there's parallels in the regular or not, but yeah, when I saw that black, I was like, oh, there's gonna be some kind of parallel. Yeah, that's cool. And it's a Logan O'Hoppy, so that's nice. I like that. So we're gonna set that back here too. I tell you what, we're gonna stick it in front of this guy because that's a little bit better than him. All right, so do we have another parallel? No, not a parallel in this pack. All right, so. Don't know if we're doing any more parallels or not, we, but the way this box is gone, we could get something really awesome in this box. So we've already got some pretty good stuff. So let's see, do we have, we have another numbered card. Oh, 
I saw numbers. Okay. Let's see. Hopefully it's something good. Okay. So, Miguel Castro. It is a blue. So, that's like four numbered cards we pulled out of this box. We pulled a gold. We pulled this blue shimmer. We pulled the Logan O'Hoppy. And we pulled the Black Cat Bobby Miller. All out of one box. That, wow. That is crazy. So we pulled four number cards out of this box. And we still got two cards to go. And it looks like we do have one more parallel to go. So let's see what it is. All right. And it's just a plain Rob Ref Schneider. So nothing fancy on that one. But I can't complain. I mean, that was easily the best box that I've opened. It was definitely the best box. I mean, we got these two numbered. This one numbered to 2023. This one numbered to, what is this one numbered to? 999, yeah, the loser 999. So we got a 2023 and a 999 out of that box. Then we got the Logan O'Hoppy MLB Stars, Stars of the MLB Black, numbered to 25. And then we also got the Bobby Miller Black Cat, which is the first Black Cat we've opened, the first numbered Halloween parallel that we've opened. And it was numbered to 10. So that box was fire. That last box that we opened was amazing. Kind of makes me wish I'd bought more of these now, but <laughs> I may have to go in and buy more. I don't know. Um, but yeah, these, that, that was an amazing box. This is the best box that I've opened so far. Yeah. So this and this are probably definitely going to get sent in to get graded. And so is this, this one right here. These are probably all going to get sent in to be graded. And there's a couple others that I opened in previous ones that I'm probably going to send to get graded as well. It's Logan O'Hoppy and this Miguel Vargas and then this. Luis Medina and Jordan Walker, Kodai Singa, and Michael Harris. Those will probably all get sent in to get graded. Michael Harris because I want to keep it. Um, a couple of these other ones I'd be willing to get rid of. But these two being a 75, I figure they're worth getting graded. This one being a 99. Uh, Jordan Walker's you know, going to be a good player. So he might be worth going on to getting graded. And the Kodai Singa might be worth it. So I don't know. I have to decide on those. But I will definitely be sending these three off. Because I think these three are going to be good good things to get graded. And then probably the Logan O'Hoppy. Uh, the other ones I'll have to decide on. I'll probably send the Harris off just for myself. Just to keep it. But yeah. So that was that was pretty awesome box there. That was a good way to, to go out. Was to go out with, with hitting five numbered cards in one box. That is definitely the record for me so far. Five numbered cards. And hitting two Halloween parallels in one box. And getting a number to 10 and a number to 25. So, hopefully you liked that video. Uh, come back, watch more videos, and subscribe to the channel. Uh, some of these things that I have up here that I, I'm not interested in keeping, I'll be putting on my on my um, Whatnot page uh, in my shop on there. Uh, I'm listed as MTG Boot on there as well. I'll probably be posting some of these in my shop. So, you can feel free to check my shop out on there. Um, but... Hopefully you enjoy these videos I've been doing and we'll see if I come back hunting for more Halloween. If not, we'll be hunting for Easter in a couple, couple months. So thanks for watching the video. Have a good day.